Is he still alive, the American dream? What do you think, huh? And we just got clear to close today. 13, 13 days clear to close the Lomelis family. Congratulations, Andy, Jazz, Esther. Thank you for trusting and giving us the opportunity. We did it. He looks very easy at the beginning. And the last two, three days was like a roller coaster. Oh my goodness. Incredible. This business you never know, huh? And last but not least, do you think should I get a dog for my kids? My parents, Sebastian, can ask him for dogs. Uh, I have an opportunity for a French dog, six months. Uh, I'm thinking about it. But anyway, uh -huh, the American dream. What do you think about the American dream? Is he still alive? Well, I'm going to give you my opinion. I was Googling what the American dream is, okay? The American dream is the idea that anyone can achieve success and prosperity through hard work and opportunity. Well, let me tell you this. I am a living experience of the American dream. I came to America with $3,000 20 years ago with a bunch of dreams. Not only the American dream, the Carlos Lopez dream, the Venezuelan dream, every kind of dream. And I believe exist. I believe in America and I love America. And I believe the American dream is still alive. It's everything up to you, nobody else. And yes, I believe on this Google search, the American dreams can achieve, anyone can achieve success and prosperity with hard work. Hard work. If you're coming to America expecting to get things, entitled because you're in America, you can get things. That's not the way it is. You have to get it, earn it, hard work every day, find a solution, give value, take the opportunity and run with that and grow with that and make it better. I don't know, in my family, in the Lopez family, we have this saying that, Get things better the way that you find them. Whenever you go to a place, you go to a fast food place, you go to the park, any place. Leave the place better than the way you found that place. And that's the same way for me in America. Coming to America is not to take advantage, it's not to, to, to expect something that I'm gonna get just because I'm here or become an American, and I'm American by the way. I'm here to make America better or feel that I'm living America better than when I found it. And, and I like the idea and I believe, and I just today, the Clear to Glow for 13 days, as a young couple, I think they are 23, 24 years old, first jobs, they are not making that much money and they are able to buy a house, three bedrooms, two bathrooms, a mortgage payment around $3,200, yes, a little stretch out, they were maxing out the ratios, but they believed in having a home and start a family and they say, they give it a try. And we got approved, we got them approved. Thanks Esther for the referral, Esther Perez, congratulations on your clear to close with BGA properties. Uh, they couldn't believe it when we got the approval. They were like, really, are, we, are you sure we approve? Are you sure we can buy a house? And yes, we did it and clear to close and hopefully we're closing on Friday, getting the keys probably Monday. And yes, I believe the American dream is still alive. I believe on that and I believe on America. I believe that you can do it if you want to, you work hard for it and keep working. You're not gonna stop, okay? It's not about buying a house. It's not about having kids. It's, it's, it's just about the whole thing, the family, the love. And anyway, and yes, there is a lot of money. You want to make a lot of money. If you want to pay a little money, you can make a little money. It's up to you. However you see you, if you have limits, you limit. If you have goals, you goals. If you see you're driving or you're thriving and, and you want to go farther, you can go farther. There is no limit. Check Elon Musk. Elon Musk wasn't from here, huh? He's another immigrant. This land is for immigrants. Of course, you have to do the best and get everything together and get everything right. By the way, uh, so yes, clear to close, congratulations to the Mele family. Um, huh, should I get a dog? What do you think for my kids? Barbara says she will do anything. She will take care of the dogs. She's gonna pick up the poop and the pee and clean everything. Sebastian is like, no, I don't wanna do that even though I wanna have a dog. I have an opportunity, thank you Virginia, Vicky, uh, fresh dogs. I'm thinking about it, but the aunt, she wanna have a dog. Now she has the dogs right now. I already washed them, I already bathed them. Now let's see in the next two days what's gonna happen. Well, that's it for now. I love you, peace out. I'm going to Sebastian's game right now. And hopefully I'm gonna get another clear to close soon for the uh, Santiago family and Duarte and Hernandez. Bye-bye, I love you, take care, thank you.